What's going on everyone? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Josh and in this video today I'm going to be covering a new scent from Defined Beard Company called Ace of Fades. Now that scent is actually not brand new. It's like two to three weeks old. This video is a little bit late but it did give me the opportunity to use this multiple times to get a good feel for what I thought of this scent. Now this is supposed to be a barbershop scent. I know a lot of you guys out there love barbershop scents uh, and if you're a fan of barbershop scents go ahead and hit that like button for me uh, but you guys know that I am not the biggest fan of barbershop scents uh, there's a few that I've liked here or there um, so I'm gonna let you guys know what I think of this new release from Define Beard Company uh, right now if you're new to the channel, please consider hitting that subscribe button for me. It's gonna help the channel grow so we can reach new beardsmen out there who just don't know about beard care or maybe need a little bit more help with their beard care routines. Like I said in the intro, today we are talking about Ace of Fades. This is from Define Beard Company. I will note that this is a new top. I kind of like the look of it though, the white label with the white top and the clear bottle. I don't know, overall pretty cool looking. Um, not a huge difference from some of the older ones, but still, Pretty cool. Now the scent profile on this is talcum, Egyptian musk, amber, sandalwood, and rum. So out of bottle, I noticed that you get a lot of talcum out of this one. Definitely reminiscent of a barbershop style scent right out the gate. <clears throat> However, when you open this one up and get it in beard is when this one sort of evolves to me. Yeah, I get a lot of that like Egyptian musk, I think. Yeah, it's an Egyptian musk. Sandalwood, I don't get a ton of, to be real honest with you, but I do smell that rum. So it's like the Egyptian musk, rum, and talcum that I'm really pulling out of this. I think amber is sort of that, what was that? I think it's a middle note or something like that. I'm not the best with my scents, um, but it, it's, it's, it's hidden within the blend. I don't really smell the amber. To me, it doesn't come out a ton, and nor does that sandalwood, but that rum, Egyptian musk, and that like talcum powder type smell, or talcum, I guess. Yeah, the, the, it's not as powdery when you put it in the beard. <clears throat> so overall, I'm gonna say this is probably my favorite barbershop scent. Like I said, I don't typically like barbershop scents. Uh, this one I have gone to a couple of times since its release and since receiving it. Um, so I do actually enjoy this one. Like I said, probably my favorite barbershop scent that exists. Now I haven't tried like every barbershop scent like some of you guys have. Um, you know, it's just not something that I typically enjoy. Uh, but after receiving this one, I really do. I kind of like this one. Now, Emily doesn't like it. She just despises barbershop scents in general. Uh, but I do like this one, like I said. Let me know in the comments down below what your favorite barbershop scent is. Let me also know if you have tried this scent and what you pick up in it. If you want to save some money on Define Beard Company and you want to try this scent out, I will put a discount code here. I'll put it in the description and I will also pin it in the comments just in case you guys wanna come back and find it later. Thank you guys so much for watching. That's gonna complete the video. If you haven't already, please consider hitting that like button and consider again subscribing to the channel for more beard care related content. See you guys next time. Just remember to continue embracing your beard and embrace the beard life. See ya.